Are you in this audience this afternoon? Sinner? God hates sin, but He loves the sinner. He loves you so much that He gave His only begotten Son that He might drink the bitter cup for you. Remember, He became you that you might become Him. He become a sinner, a separated from the Father, when He screamed, My God, why has Thou forsaken me? He was separated from God in His death, that you in your death might have God's presence. He become a child of sin, your sins, not His own, yours, that you might become a child of obedience. He took your place as a time creature that you might take His place as an eternal son and daughter of God. Has the morning star shed any light on your path? Would you love Him and would like to be remembered in prayer? Would you raise up your hands and signify, I love Him. God loves a sinner. And everything that's on earth will praise Him someday. Someday you'll bow to His knee, to your knee at His feet. You'll bow as a reconciled by His works of reconciliation as you accepting Him as your propitiation and been washed by the water, by the Word and the waters of separation and become altogether a child of the living God. You'll worship Him in peace. Outside of that, it'll be a fearful thing. For if the, if the righteous be scarcely saved, where will the sinner and ungodly appear? And that might happen to you before you leave the door. Will you be reconciled this afternoon by believing on Him and accepting Him as your personal Savior? One hand again before, how many hands rather, before we pray? Think of it, accepting. God bless you, little fella. That's good, a little boy. Raise his hand. You say, he's too young. Oh, no, he isn't. Jesus said, suffer little children to come to me. Yes, sir, honey boy, you're welcome. Bless your little heart. God save you. May mommy take you to the church and be baptized and call upon the name of the Lord. Or his little Samuel, remember, not much older than you, that was called a prophet, heard the voice of the Lord, the first open vision for a long time in Israel. Someone else now wants to be remembered in prayer just now, saying, God be merciful. God bless you, lady. God bless you back there, too. God bless you, little girl. God bless you, lady. Another, just now, we're going to pray. All right. I wonder if our brother, while we got our heads bound, would just hum or play that song softly, just as I am. Now, that's your plea to the Lord Jesus. Brother Branham, can I be assured that that morning star is your yes, dear friend? Wherever two or more are gathered in my name, I'll be in their midst. That same lovely one is your. Now, you raise your hands, and you that did not raise your hands and yet believe you should, won't you now just in your heart say, Just as I am, Lord, without one plea, but that thy blood was shed for me. And because I promise with my hand up, I believe, O oh, Lamb of God, I come, I come. Will you do it while we pray? Lord, Thou hast said in Thy eternal Word, which Jesus said the Scriptures cannot be broken. No man can come to me except my Father draws him first. Oh, how lovely that is to think that the Father is in here today. The Holy Spirit is drawing. And literally dozens have raised their hands. The Holy Spirit is drawing. God the Father giving to His Son love gifts in commemoration of His great, all-sufficient sacrifice which please God to forget sin. If Jesus was so willing to do all of that, the Father's heart was so broken up till He was willing to forget all about sin. And now He speaks to the sinner. 
saying, child of my creation, I would like to lead you to my son today. I would like to put you in his custody so that he could guide you into eternal life. Made that pitted it man, woman, boy, girl, and even little children. May they now come to that place where the morning star is hanging at the cross now. May there with deep contrition break down every barrier. Throw away all self and surrender that once supreme surrender to the Lord Jesus. And go back like the Magi's rejoicing as they go to their home to bring the message that the King has been born in their heart, the King that will rule their life from today on. Grant it, Father, as we wait on Thee. Through Jesus' name, my son, we ask it. Amen. With your heads bowed. Without one plea, but that thy blood was shed for me because I promise. I'll believe, O Lamb of God, I come. Do you really mean it now? If you do every person in the building, it means that you're now surrendering all to Him. Will you just raise your hand while we sing again? Raise up your right hand. Any person's in here that loves the Lord Jesus... Whether you've been a Christian, whether you haven't, right now you say, I surrender my whole life. Let the morning star, the light of God lead me to my eternal destination.